Hi, I'm Michael Maturja, Executive Director of Broadleaf Health and Education Alliance. Broadleaf is a startup nonprofit that uses innovative approaches to school based healthcare to improve the lives of children in the rural eastern Himalayas. Our aspiration is to create a world class development organization tackling tough problems in a neglected region of the world. Broadleaf demonstrates that quality healthcare has no geographic boundaries. Since 2011, we have implemented a next generation model for school health in primary schools of the rural Darjeeling Hills in India. Our program utilizes community health workers to deliver health and hygiene education as well as basic primary health services. Already this program has shown data-driven impact. Our children show a 34% increase in health knowledge, 6% decrease in waterborne illness, and 11 additional days of school attended. Working in our partner schools has brought us face to face with the struggles of children with mental illness. Mental health is emerging as one of our generation's crucial global health challenges. Globally, 10 to 20% of children suffer from a diagnosable mental health condition. Tragically, 90% of these children receive no specialist care. For children residing in remote and rural communities such as the Eastern Himalayas, this treatment gap approaches a startling 100%. Of the 450 children in our school health program, not a single child receives specialist and professional support. Both here at Harvard and in India, there is a growing political and financial climate that makes this the right time to tackle the child mental health treatment gap. HMS recently launched the program in Global Mental Health, and Partners in Health is rapidly expanding its mental health care systems in Haiti and Rwanda. The government of India also recognizes the pressing need of mental health. Efforts are underway to develop community-based systems of care for adults with mental illness. Unfortunately though, despite being uniquely vulnerable, the field of child mental health remains neglected. This is acutely true in the Darjeeling Hills, where there is no public system and no private system in place for children with mental illness. Locally, Broadleaf is the only organization with the interest, capacity, and platform to change this reality. We intend to take advantage of our position within this market space to be an early innovator in the field of child mental health. Our experience has directly led us to the breakthrough idea that a school-based system of mental health care delivered by community health workers is the most viable, cost-effective, and scalable approach to closing this treatment gap. To accomplish this goal, we require $60,000 of initial funding to pilot and prove our intervention. Funds provided through the Dean's Challenge will cover the startup costs for putting into place a visionary program that can be expanded to cover thousands of schools across the Eastern Himalayas. I would now like to turn it over to JC, our project manager based in Darjeeling. To confront the problem of child mental health, we must first address the severe shortage of health professionals. In the Darjeeling Hills, for a population of half a million, there is only one psychiatrist. There are no social workers, therapists, or psychologists dedicated to the care of children. We believe the solution to tackling this human resource crisis is task sharing, or the shifting of responsibilities from professional providers to lay community health workers. Task sharing has been extremely successful in enhancing care for people with HIV, as well as for mothers and for newborns. Broadleaf wants to be among the first to apply this strategy to child mental health. I would now like to use the story of Nima, one of our community health workers, and of Raju, one of her students, to illustrate the potential of Broadleaf's approach. Nima noticed Raju struggling in class. He had trouble sitting still and was easily distracted. Often overwhelmed, his teachers resulted, resorted to verbal and physical punishment. Using broadly screening tools, Nima identified Raju as one of several children with a mental health challenge. Guided by Broadleaf's care pathways, 
Nima worked with Raji's family to have him evaluated by a Darjeeling-based pediatrician. Raji received a diagnosis of ADHD and was placed on low-dose medication. Using Broadleaf's support tools, Nima engages in regular counseling sessions with Raju to help him mitigate the day-to-day -day challenges that he faces. Within the larger school environment, Nima helps Raju's teachers adapt a positive behavior plan that uses positive reinforcement rather than corporal punishment. Nima also works with the parents to help them develop strategies for promoting Raju's social skills. The end result of Nima's activities is that Roger receives the care he desperately deserves, a school environment that supports his learning, and a family empowered to ensure that Roger achieves his full potential. This approach to child mental health is inherently scalable. In every rural community, there are children like Roger struggling with a potential mental health challenge. Primary schools that provide a venue for reaching these children, and community members like Nima who can deliver comprehensive mental health care. Nima directly improves the lives of about 100 students. By 2017, Broadleaf envisions having 10 community health workers caring for 1,000 children. Beyond this, our approach can be readily transported and replicated across the Eastern Himalayas. Key to our ability to achieve this is our tremendous team and strong relationship with stakeholders. Broadleaf's team is specifically built to combine high-level technical innovation with a deep understanding of the communities we serve. We have been trained as physicians, educators, psychiatrists, and development professionals, either here at Harvard or other leading American universities. Perhaps more important though than our technical backgrounds is the abundance of experience we have living and working in the Eastern Himalayas. Cumulatively, our American staff has over eight years of experience in this region. This all began in 2007 when my wife Den and I spent a year living in Holderkoti, a small village on a tea estate in the Darjeeling Hills. During this time, we worked as teachers at a local primary school. Ill health prevented our students from ever reaching their true potential. We returned for another year in 2011 to found Broadleaf Health and Education Alliance in order to address the challenges faced by these students and these communities. Our team has since expanded to include Jessica Mausner, an evaluation specialist who leverages her technical skills and previous experiences in the Indian education sector to gather concrete evidence of Broadleaf's impact. Christina Cruz, a technical advisor to Broadleaf, is a future child psychiatrist with experience implementing school-based mental health projects in the Boston area. In Darjeeling, Broadleaf's school health program is overseen by J.C. Cole Morgan, a management professional and participant in the Clinton Fellowship for Service. Additionally, Priscilla Geary, our main project officer, grew up in Darjeeling and has a master's degree in psychiatric social work. We are even lucky enough to have one of the world's top talents in global mental health, Dr. Giuseppe Raviola, the director of Harvard's program in global mental health, serve as an advisor and mentor to our work. We believe that our team's ability to level top-notch strategic thinking with smart boots on the ground distinguishes broadly from other organizations in India. Broadly's relationship with local, regional, and national stakeholders is another key strength. Not only are we regularly approached by communities requesting that we expand into their schools, but there is also substantial support for our work from public officials in the district health and education ministries. Through our Dean's Challenge Mentor, we are beginning to cultivate relationships with officials at both the state and the national level. The demonstrated success of our school health program, our exceptional team, and this network of support all adds up to an organization that is best positioned to take on the problem of child mental health. Impact validates expansion. Broadleaf has already proven that we are capable of running an impactful school health program. What we are proposing to you 
is an opportunity to kickstart an innovative approach to child mental health. We will pilot this program over five years. This pilot phase is necessary to accomplish two goals. First, to test our hypothesis that it is possible to integrate child mental health into existing school health programs. Second, to demonstrate the impact and scalability of this intervention. In 2013, initial funds from the Dean's Health Challenge are being used to create and translate intervention materials. In 2014, we will begin implementation in 13 to 15 primary schools. Over three years, we will go through a period of ambitious but controlled expansion to the point where we are impacting a thousand students in 33 rural primary schools. We project that at this level, the average cost will be $594 per school. To accomplish this initial expansion of the plan, Broadleaf requires an investment of $60,000 over the next five years. We have developed an exceptionally strong evaluation framework with tangible deliverables to assess our intervention's feasibility, acceptability, and effectiveness. Data gathered at the end of each project year will be used to make structured improvements. Unambiguous evidence of impact will allow us better to better mobilize, support, engage public and private sector partners, fundraise, and pursue implementation at scale. Working in a rural and remote region of India is not an easy task, but we have gained confidence through our experience. As a small but efficient U.S.-based startup, we have a strategy for mitigating the current and anticipated risks of operating our program. One challenge we face is operational and administrative limitations on the ground in India. To surmount this, Broadleaf has cultivated a partnership with Mercy Corps, one of the largest and most respected global development organizations, and we are able to take advantage of Mercy Corps' operational and administrative resources in Darjeeling. Another risk is that much of our technical expertise is based in the U.S. In order to reduce the burden of distance and to achieve quality assurance of our mental health intervention, members of our leadership team will make routine visits to the Darjeeling office. Additionally, we already have an India-based board member who makes quarterly visits to our project site. Lastly, we will need to successfully transition from a pilot program to a broadly implemented intervention. This requires that we further diversify our funding stream, accessing financial resources from the public and private sectors. Through a combination of private donations and proceeds from our annual Darjeeling to Kathmandu mountain bike ride, we have already raised $45,000 to fully fund our established school health program through our next project year. However, as a young startup, we do not yet have the donor base to support an additional resource-intensive intervention. The $60,000 from the Dean's Challenge will be used to kickstart our new mental health intervention through 2017. Beyond through 2017, we will pursue two avenues for achieving financial sustainability and scale. In India, enormous public funds are available for school health. We believe that we can tap into these funds by building off of our established relationships with key government officials. Within the private sector, Broadleaf has cultivated relationships with leading funders in India, such as the American India Foundation and the Dharabji Tata Trust. Additionally, our partnership with Bursi Corps gives us a clear line of sight to other top funders, such as the Gates Foundation and even USAID. The time is right to invest in models of care to support millions of children across the eastern Himalayas with mental health challenges. Broadleaf is well positioned to bring change through our deep understanding of the local context, the incredible technical talent of our team, and our operational experience and capacity. Through integration of mental health care into comprehensive school health, we can transform care and redefine mental health as a crucial component of next generation school health programs. Thank you.